There we go, and we'll go ahead and build up a door right here. Ain't that adorable? <laughs> Hello there, everybody. There's more baby in 13 here. Hey, welcome to Founder's Fortune. This game is a lot like The Sims mixed with a city building game or a town building game. And for right now, this is going to be fun. And as you all may have known, I did in fact like um, do a live stream on this game before, and it was on a previous update. And it was a good game to me. But for right now, it has a traders update. So that's going to be fun, which means the staff will be able to trade with people, which is totally great. And then maybe we'll be able to get some salaries and stuff from our people, earn money, and so forth like that. Which is seriously going to be awesome. Okay, and as you all may know, this thing is like um, the difficulty right now. So we got easy, normal, and hard. And also is that... I'm gonna, we're gonna go for... Yeah, we're gonna go for exciting world, which is normal mode. I am no sissy. Or I'm, I am no coward when it comes to... Freaking putting on with calm world. We're gonna go for this one. Alright, now then we gotta choose our colonist. Our starting colonist, if you will. Okay, I think the first one that we're gonna want is a forester. Okay, the first one is gonna be a scholar. Okay, allergic to apples. That might not be good because I think we normally have a starting area to be... to be apples, so maybe that's not a good idea to start out with right now. Um... Doctor and a minor. I came limping because of an accident. Rosalind has a bad leg and is limping. She walks slower than I get. No worry about that. Has trouble sleeping and doesn't rest as well as others. Takes double the time to fully rest compared to the others. I get no problem there. Uh, let's see. Um, Forester. Um, we want is a Forester. Okay, let's get a forester. Pessimist, what's that? A glass half empty kind of guy receives a permanent mood penalty. Uh, um Okay, this might work. Oh, bad health. Uh, receives a permanent mood penalty. Uh. Okay, it should work. Uh, no. Jeez, this is hard. Um. Let's get. Um. I want a forester. A miner, doctor, scholar. Um, oh, that's not good. Um, soldier and a farmer. Farmer. Um, allergic to apples. Um, I guess this over here can work. Yeah, okay, we're gonna choose you to be as our forester. And... We're gonna want is a miner. I'm allergic to potatoes, but he'll go ahead and eat apples. Okay, this will work. Oh, an overeater. Archibald loves food and isn't always available. Okay, might not be a good idea. Especially now that we are in a limited amount of food. Um, definitely wanna get ourselves a miner. Uh, where... This works! Okay, he's dumb, which means he can't go beyond these two. Which is totally awesome. Okay, and he's allergic to apples, so we're just gonna go ahead and try to get ourselves, um... 
some other things to eat, like maybe get him some, get him at, get him some potatoes or something. Okay, great. All right, so we're gonna start out in a new world. Okay, so we got apples here. Yes, we got apples here, apples there. Okay, so let's go ahead and set up our little campsite right here in order to get from here to here. And we'll stash our lamp post on our bonfire, which is definitely very important because that's how at the moment you would get more people. Okay, so for right now I want David, you can head go over here and you construct that. Okay, and then you want a basket of raw food. Let's put you over over here. Um, let's let's put you down right here near the bonfire because I want to make up. I'm going to keep the room that we have right here for when we're going to build our people's their houses and stuff. So let's going to place you there. And Sebastian, I need to head over here and start constructing. Okay, great. We should have cotton near us. Yep, right over here. Great. Um, stone and iron right over here. Great. Okay, you're starting to build that. Okay, great. Okay. Okay, so now we got a wish fulfilled. Okay, here's the thing, everybody. Is that if you, these people would have wishes. And you need to fulfill those wishes in order for you to keep... To have to, to grow their satisfaction points, and the more satisfaction points you get, the more uh, reward points you get, and the more more and the more reward points that you get, the more likely you'll be able to um, remove a trait. Like at some point, once we get one trait point, we'll be able to get rid of allergic allergic to apples, which would definitely help us out in the long run. So that way, he would, you know be as saying icky apples or something like that. You get the idea. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. So, he wants a sleeping spot. Okay, so, okay, so we need to, we definitely gotta get these guys some housing. So we got only 4 95 wood. Alright, so we got to get to work at building a house. Okay, so we definitely want to have a floor. Yeah, let's go ahead and... Oh, not that. Yeah, okay, we want to have a floor. Like, we gotta make sure the house is not too big at the start. We'll get more, we'll get more, um... We will get more wood as we go along. And once we get more wood... Okay, there you go. We'll start with 36 wood. Okay, there you go. 36 wood. Okay. Yeah, that should do it for now on the housing. We want it to be a big enough house. Okay, so for right now... Okay, we definitely want to have a door. Okay, we definitely want to have a door. Oh, we need to build a wall. Okay, um, there we go, and we'll go ahead and build up a door, right here, ain't that adorable, <laughs> alright, now then, Sebastian, we'll definitely gonna get you a sleeping spot, don't you worry mister, but right now, uh, let's see here, I think, um, how can I check the traits? Um, okay, um, okay, um, how do I do this? Um, how do I figure, how do I find out what my person has? Oh, yes, and as you all can see here, if you click on this, you'll be able to rename the people. So, if you want to go ahead and be a part of this village, uh, please let me know down in the comment section. I'll go ahead and rename the villagers after you all out there. Alright, but for right now, um, mm -hmm. yep. we're gonna want is you at the moment to be a forester. Alright, become a forester. I'll go ahead and have you to switch a job. 
right now, but for right now, we're gonna need trees. Yeah, we're gonna want wood. Yes, kick that sucker. Kick it good. Kick that freaking thing good in your German... I think the, I think it's German Lederhosen. I am not exactly sure. <laughs> I get air go. So now we're getting 14 more wood, which is totally great. You can actually get wood by kicking your foot. I really am hoping that... I really am hoping that this person's foot does not end up being... Um, amputated or stuff like that. <laughs> Alright, so for right now, let's go ahead and continue constructing our wall. Don't worry, you will die enough resources. Okay, yes. Okay, then we definitely want to get ourselves, let's see, how many cotton do I got? 20 cotton. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, um, let's put that bed right there. Okay, and then... Yep. Okay, hunger is going great, stamina is going up, okay. Oh, and by the way, um, what you saw what I did on the tree when I got this person to become a forester, it actually automates production. Like, for instance, if you were to, let's say, um, you right-click on, like, you, you click on, you click, like, you click on this person, and you have, have him to go over here, and you become a forester, and he'll automate the, um, the wood production. Which is exactly what we need right now in order to make a house for our people. Alright, but for right now, let's go ahead and have you to head on over here and construct that bed. I mean, that sleeping bag. And also, at some point, is that your people... Okay, okay what's your name? Your name is David. So, we need you to be David's house. There, your expectation fulfilled. So now he is happy. So now let's go ahead and head over here. Okay, let's go ahead and put you possibly over here. There you go. Mm -hmm. Okay, we definitely gotta get him his own sleeping spot, which will come. Alright, so for right now, let's head over here and start constructing. Okay, we have only two wood. Well, that's not good. We need more wood. There we go. Okay, now then, let's have you to be Sebastian. There we go. So now we got wish fulfilled. I mean, expectation fulfilled. So now, they should be able to get themselves up a little bit more earlier. No, mister. Mm -hmm. I need you. Oh yeah, you need hunger. Um, are you are you the one who is allergic to apples? Frick. I know. Need a work. Need a research station. Yes. Oh great. How many apples do I have? Okay, we got tomatoes. Okay, that's good. All right, let's go ahead and. Okay, where's my raw food thing? Oh, it's right over here. Alright, there you go. Yep. Okay. Yep. My wish came true. I can get what I want. Okay, so now we are good. So he has food and he owns the sleeping spot. So now, so now then we definitely want to have you to go over here and start cutting down trees. So we can start continuing to build these people their homes. Like that's why it says here, get a bedroom. 
So that's what we're gonna need to do. We need to make up this entire area here to be as a bedroom. What's this? Oh, that's equipment. Oh, nice. Alright, so now Yapsi, his stamina is definitely becoming quicker to go up than it is to sleep on the floor, which means that his, um, th his stats here about, ne there we go. Okay, so now we're getting wood, totally awesome. Okay. Okay, how okay, twelve twenty two. Okay. Great, that should be enough in order for me to finish up the rest of that wall. So I'll have one of their expectations fulfilled. There we go. See? Wish fulfilled because yep. we now made an entire room. Get a place to store weapons in his house. Of course, he is a soldier. Uh, do I have anything right now for storing weapons? Of course I do. We got a weapon rack. Okay, um, of course we got a weapon display case, we got an armor stand. Okay, that was not here in the, um, in the previous update I did do on this game. Oh man, excuse me everybody, I gotta go. Okay, sorry about that everybody. There, I think things are fine. Okay, auto save complete. Great. Okay, so now we're getting 23 wood. Entirely awesome, so now we got to continue along with building up our houses. So let's go and start building up that there. Definitely want to have that wall over here. Of course, not enough resources. And of course, it's going to look rickety and stuff like that because it is the best that I can do at the moment. Um. Yep. And once I can figure out, I. Think. Okay, he's a forester. Um, how can I remember which important possessions? Yes. Okay, civilian equipment, combat equipment. Can fight with a wooden sword. Okay, he's definitely the soldier of our group. Okay. Okay, come on, we need that wood. Okay, now then, 11 wood. Darn it, come on. Okay, five wood, I just need one more wood. Okay, we got we got we got immigrants. Okay, a few new a few immigrants have seen our signifier and just arrived in a small boat. Send the colonists to accept them. Okay, um. Mm -hmm. Okay, where is? Okay, Davidson Construction will have you to be, to accept the immigrant. Welcome to our little colony. 
Okay, which means is that we're gonna possibly need to get you to have your own house as well. There you go, so now... So now his wish should be fulfilled. Yep, see? He sleeps inside now. Okay, colonists joined. Okay, Nathaniel. Um... Okay, Nathaniel, for right now, um, I... let's see... Okay, you're the soldier, and I guess Sebastian is gonna be our researcher, which... Oh, wait a minute. No, he's two and a forester. Okay, so he is going to be our forester. Because he gets more... more wood. Okay, so Nathaniel, you're gonna be our researcher. Okay, so... So until we can get um, Nathaniel to have his own room... We are just got to go ahead and, and put the research station in this one. And just name this one Nathaniel's so then... Yeah, we're gonna be fine. Alright, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, farming. Oh, wait a minute, farming? Okay, soil, potatoes, wheat, pumpkins, ceiling plants, wooden, wooden well for irrigation, for the kitchen, and a bakery. Ooh. Okay, there it is. 15 wood for the research station. Okay, which we don't have right now. Okay, Nathaniel, um... Do you have any idea? Yeah, a payment to coins every day. Of course, I don't have coins. Okay. Think out of the way we're gonna be great. Okay, there we go. Okay, David. Um You're gonna be possibly the soldier in our place, so we want you to be here. Um Science. Yes, I know. Um, I need more wood. Hey, Sebastian, I need to head over here and start cutting down more trees. Ah, uh, darn it, I didn't know that he was hungry. Oh, man. Yes, kick that mother effing tree! Kick it real good. Yes, kick that tree. I just... Okay. Well, I wait up on this person to kick the tree. Okay, I don't know that text. <laughs> Alright. Okay, he's eating. Okay. Okay, there we go. That should be enough. Okay, yep. David. Um, I need you to go in over here. Okay. Um, I need you to head over here. And where is work? You definitely want to have a stand. And we'll put you... Right like so. There you go. You start constructing that. Oops. Okay, we definitely possibly want to have woodworking. Yeah, so we can get a tool maker's work tool maker's workshop so we'll be able to create tools for people so they'll be even more efficient. Like we can make axes and stuff, which is totally gonna to be awesome, which means we don't even need to have a um thing here. No, I want you to construct this thing right away. Excellent. There you go. So now... Okay, so now you're starting to be more productive and stuff. Okay, so Nathaniel, um, I needed to go in over here and become a scholar. Perfect. Level one in the scholar anyway. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to want is to choose a research topic. 
Um, the research topic should be right here in this corner. Ah, there it is. Okay, now then I want to research you. There it goes. Oh, now we'll have Nathaniel to head over here. Oh, not enough resources. Okay, I don't have enough resources to... To, um... To get that. So we gotta wait up on crystals, which you can get from here. Okay, and I definitely gotta get you a pickaxe. Okay, one crystal. We need five. We need five crystals in order to get that research done. Okay, I know. Okay, I think I... Oh, okay, never mind. I guess we just need one, I guess. Okay, let me check the research topic again. Okay, we're definitely gonna need us five, um, five crystals, so we gotta wait a bit. We'll get ourselves a miner at some point, and then he'll be, he or she will be able to get our, get more crystals for our scholar, so he doesn't need to bash the rocks. Okay, so things are going great. I think we got 32 food. Yep. 10 potatoes. 7 tomatoes. And 15 apples. Okay, that is great. Okay, and then at some point we are going to go ahead and do farming as well. Okay, maybe I can speed things up a little bit. That's right, mister. Use that foot. Kick it, kick it, kick it. <laughs> All right, there we go. <laughs> All right. Okay, now then, let's go ahead and get you to go over here and analyze that crystal. Okay, maybe maybe it's a good idea to do farming. Yeah, we definitely want to make sure to. To get crops going for the, get crops going for the next season. That way we don't end up being hungry. And the farm area is possibly going to be like right over here, near the um, near the apple trees. And also, it should be pretty darn close. Yeah, near the apple trees here, and we'll be able to get the farmer to go in over here to pick that cotton. So then we'll be able to get ourselves another bed. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you need a job, right? Um. Okay, bad dream. Okay. Um. Okay, we got 68 wood. Okay, that is great news. Okay, we Okay, and you should be able to analyze the uh, thing. Oh yeah, and each time this thing goes in a full circle, the um, corner thing right up here will show up as one, two, three, four, five, etc. There you go, see? One. Okay, and also depends on your um, position in a... Um, your villagers, like for instance, is that um, the more your um, people learn and stuff, the more productive they will be. So make sure to keep them happy and and get their levels up in their jobs. And boom, they'll become the, the most productive people that you have ever seen. Mm -hmm. Alright, David, um, you need to go get yourself some sleep. Okay, well then everybody, it looks like this is going to be it for today's video. 
And man, I think we made some progress. And once again, if you all want to become a part of the village, um, please let me know down in the comment section. But anyways, have a good day, everyone. That's right, mister. Use that foot. <laughs> kick it, kick it, kick it, kick it.